This last week, CentraCare doctors saw an increased number of patients coming in with gastroenteritis, also commonly called the stomach flu. But it's anything but the flu. It's actually an intestinal virus caused by the norovirus, something we've been hearing about in the news recently with some uh, cruise ship epidemics running out there. But we're seeing it in our community. It's that time of year. So joining us today is Dr. Jonathan Schwartzman with the Lee Road Centric Care to answer some questions about gastroenteritis. Dr. Um, Schwartzman, what exactly is gastroenteritis? So gastroenteritis is an inflammation, an infection of the intestines. And as a result of that inflammation, any food that's taken in is just going to move through you faster. And as a result, you're going to have watery diarrhea, vomiting, nausea, and abdominal cramps, and sometimes some low-grade fevers. Okay. Well, what do you recommend a patient can do about this at home to treat the symptoms if they think they have gastroenteritis? First thing would be keeping well hydrated, uh, pushing the fluids, the Gatorade, the Pedialyte. Um, if they're feeling nauseous, then probably staying away from foods and just trying to go with the liquids to begin with. Uh, with this kind of diarrhea, Imodium is, is definitely a possibility to uh, limit the uh, amount of visits to the bathroom. Uh, rest, staying home, uh, trying to stay away from people, and time. Usually with the average gastroenteritis, you're talking from a day to five days in terms of its duration. 